All right. So how, how involved in system tuning are you guys? Are you like really leaning on uh, system engineers just 100% or are you kind of getting involved and looking at smart and stuff? Go ahead, Vince. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I probably have a different response from Jay, but just having a studio background and starting in clubs, like I, I'm sometimes I know just enough to be dangerous with the systems. I work very, very closely and I need someone who's very strong and uh, confident in their abilities and can also explain themselves. I, I feel like it's a, it's a hallmark of understanding. If you can't, if you can't communicate what you're doing uh, and, and we can't get on page on what our strategies are, it's just not going to work out. So I'm, I view that relationship as maybe the most single important relationship uh, at this point in my career. Um, what, like so not yeah. you and I? Oh yeah, no. <laughs> Bye, see you guys later. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> yeah, I should, man, come, on, I should, I mean, come, on, I should yeah. come on and be your systems guy. You, I, <laughs> I don't know if you can put up with me. I, I, hear, I'm, <laughs> I hear I'm a pain in the ass. Uh, oh, I know. <laughs> I was yeah. that with me, man. Jay, like yeah. the best mix I've ever had is when you were system teching show that I did. Oh, thank you, thank you. The, the, the best mix I ever heard through the system life systems tech was you mixing Scott. So, <laughs> all right, Vince, you're out. I'm, I'm with Scott. See ya. That's fine. That's fine. We had a good run anyway. Um, I don't know. What about you, Jay? You have a bit more of a background in that. I mean, I've never, you know, I, I, I don't know. It's. I just feel like if you know, I, I'm there to, to to mix the show, and and I'm really really focused in the fact that the show that comes out of my desk every night, night after night should be exactly the same. And so I just want a systems guy that can be on board with that. But Jay has a bad, I mean, you've, you've done a lot more systems teching than I have. I'm a bit different. I, I, I do a lot of systems teching stuff as well as mixing. And I really, I enjoy that as almost as much as I enjoy mixing. Um, you know, I, I get as much out of that when you really get a rig dialed in and I find it as much as a challenge. Um, so I, I really enjoy it. So, I've had the same system engineer, Dan Bloom, for the past five, six years, and we have a great relationship together. He's, he's one of the best guys out there for sure. Uh, he's also a good system engineer. Um, but uh, for a while, I found myself, just because I was I was bored and I, want, I wanted to do it, I was like doing a lot, like all the smart time alignment and tuning and all stuff like that. And then I realized Dan was like completely overqualified to just be sitting up there like, you know, slinging speakers and and watching me do stuff so dude that's a really good point if you're spending your time doing someone else's job what aren't you doing for yours and and what yeah. is that other person there for i mean they're, yeah, they're yeah. the expert in that exactly so then at that point i was like well this is dumb. like you know i realized he was getting really bored so he started doing all this, the system you know tuning and stuff like that you know i'd still throw a song up at the end and listen and, and kind of do the final like eq in the system because you know, I kind of, I kind of take it like Chris Rabel was watching something he did. He said the same thing. Like, I kind of want to know where all the, all the, the bodies are hidden, you know? And if, if I, if I, if I'm tuning the rig and I know, okay, well the room's doing this here, or like, there's a weird slap coming over there. When the show starts, I'm mixing. I know, like, oh, I remember I took out this, like this 160 thing earlier and I like boosted this high end thing earlier. So I kind of have an idea, like a roadmap of where, of where to get to. But uh, I, I see, you know, I see both uh, both ways working. Um, you know, Vince's way and my way. Even though my way is right and Vince's way is wrong, but um, <laughs> um, you know, somehow Vince still has a gig, so that's cool. 